guys welcome back to world illuminate 11 i hope you're all having a great day and welcome if it is your first time checking out my channel and if it is your first time checking out the channel then please do hit the subscribe button you are very welcome here if you are new to the channel then a really warm welcome to you really glad to have you on the channel so i have really been guided to bring out a few decks and i am going to do a message that has just come through as a message for you so you know it's a message for you if you're a divine masculine or a message for you if you're a divine feminine and this is really a message to help you on your journey because everything starts with you it's all about you moving forward within yourself and that is what helps to bring in the things that you desire in your own life as well that love that you're desiring with your divine masculine when you find that inner peace when you're in a place of surrender and trusting when you are in the place of loving your life and you know you're feeling good you're raising your vibration you're elevating your thoughts which was also the message that was coming through in the short video that I did the thought for your day do check that out as well and when you're having faith and trusting so this is a message for you and you know and the, that same applies to divine masculines as well about you know being in the place of raising their vibration and having faith and trusting when it comes to the things that they're desiring as well in in their life so this is a message for you and we are just going to bring in the decks and see what messages are coming through so the first deck that i am bringing in is the angel tarot so thank you angels the guardian angel tarot what is this one it's the guardian angel tarot so thank you angels what message is coming through for everyone today what message is coming through for everyone what message is coming through okay so the cards that have come out we've got two cards that have come out the first one is out with the old and in with the new so this is powerful this is about letting go of the old you know this is letting go of the things that no longer serve you and you know bringing in the new and it says heaven is showing you a sign that is time to move in a new direction so this is about change walking away from the things that need to go and often this is because you're not happy and you feel a lack of purpose in your life this is a wake-up call to make changes that match your heart's desires and spiritual truths so powerful message coming through for you there may be certain things that you've been doing for a long time a comfort zone that you're in where there's a comic situation or you know just something that you just know is not working for you anymore it's not serving you it's not bringing you joy it's not helping you it really in your life it's not giving you that fulfillment or that success as well in your life and it's time for you to move away from that and you know it's because you're not feeling happy you're feeling a lack of purpose in your life you want to move towards towards doing something that makes you feel fulfilled that you know you know that you are doing something that is of value and something that is about giving to others as well and receiving at the same time and you know working towards your purpose in life as well so it's a wake-up call this card is a wake up call that it's now time to be out with the old to make that change when it comes to your life you know to walk away from whatever that situation is so that you can move towards the new the new that is going to bring all the things that you're desiring so it's a wake-up call to make changes that match your heart's desires and spiritual truths so you know it's about listening to your heart what is your heart guiding you to do and you know follow your heart's desires listen to your heart's desires and your spiritual truths this is about you walking and aligning your yourself and the things in your life to divine will and really aligning to the path that you're walking on now and getting away from the things that are not aligned with your spiritual truths so that's the message that's coming through for you the next card that came out is creativity and abundance and it says dear one you're being called to action so the message coming through for you today is that you're being called to action this is about stepping up into action to doing the things that you're truly here to do you're ready to accomplish great things and truly come into the fullness of who you are it's it's a time for great creativity giving birth to beloved projects or becoming a parent Follow your passion so that abundance and prosperity manifest for you. So with this card, you are being called to step up and take action to do the things that you're wanting to do, that your heart is guiding you to do, to be creative in whatever way that may be for you. Maybe time for you to do a certain project, to give um, birth to certain projects in your life, or to even become a parent or to walk away from a situation so that you can really start working on something that is there to 
help you to be more creative and you know to do your mission to do your purpose and you know and be able to bring in more abundance into your life so really powerful messages coming through for you today to walk away from what no longer serves you and to walk towards the things that are there to bring you in the life that you're truly here to live so follow your passion so that abundance and prosperity manifest for you so really beautiful messages coming through for you today okay so the next deck that we're bringing in it is the self-love deck so thank you angels what message is coming through for everyone from this deck okay so we've got two cards as well the first the card that came out is know you are safe so you're being reminded that you are safe even if it is a time for you to make that change and certain fears are coming up to walk away from the old and into the new know that you are safe you've got the whole of heaven by your side and you are loved beyond measure so they're saying to you know you are safe Protection is always available to you. You have all the resources that you need both within you and around you. So you're being reminded that you have the resources that you need to be able to make those changes. You have the strength and the power to do so and the knowledge you have that is all you have also the help that comes from heaven you know just ask and it is given to you for you to be able to get through whatever it is that you're wanting to do but when it comes to your life when it comes to your twin flame journey when it comes to all areas of your life know you are safe and you have the resources both within the knowledge the wisdom the power the strength and also around you from the love and the and the support that you get from above so really beautiful okay and you are also protected as is your journey as well the next card that came out is practice patience so in everything that you do there is no need to rush anything practice patience you know be patient and trust that everything will fall into place at the right time when it comes to your twin flame journey when it comes to other things that you may be working on conditions outside us sometimes determine the best time to move forward wait and work on something else until these conditions change so you know if for some reason the situation is not quite moving just yet know that there is a reason for that you know because you are being guided and you know it is about you being patient when it comes to the situation you know when the things are not quite happening on the 3d yet when it comes to your twin flame journey practice patience know that there is a reason behind everything that is going on in your life so the more you're feeling patience the more you're practicing patience in your life the more you have inner peace the more everything flows in your into your, in your life as well the more you can release that fear that tries to come up to sort of you know think that thing maybe things are not happening or you know something is is not working out well just have patience and trust in the universe and have that inner peace so that's the other message that's coming through for you today okay so the next card uh the next deck that we're going to bring in is the love your inner goddess so thank you angels what messages are coming through to everyone from this deck what messages are coming through from this deck what messages are coming through what messages are coming through from this deck any other message coming through from this deck okay so let's see what cards have come out here so the first message that came out is princess savior and it says this princess saves herself so this could be a prince as well this is about you being the one to do things for yourself you know not looking for someone outside of you or something else outside of you to do things for you have confidence in yourself trust in yourself go for the things that you're wanting to do you know make the changes that you want to do in your life love yourself be there for yourself you know respect yourself take care of yourself just be there to give everything to you so this princess saves herself or this prince saves himself this is about you doing things for you taking that action and going for the things that your heart is desiring saving yourself from a situation that you know is no longer serving you making that change and going for your heart's desires so that's the message that's coming through it's about you realizing that you have the power over your life you have the power to take certain action to do certain things for yourself you working with the creator with the angels you can bring in the life that you 
you desire but also you thinking positive thoughts taking positive action and you know and speaking positive words so you know you work with heaven but at the same time you're also in that place of positivity and optimism to help things to move forward to help you to create that life that you desire so it's about you saving yourself and moving forward when it comes to to your life so that's the message that's coming through here. The next card that has come out is be there for you. So, you know, that's about you being there for yourself. This is why this message was being guided to as, you know, a message for you. You're being shown here that it's about you being there for you. You know, doing the things that you're wanting to do, the things that light you up inside, if it's a creativity, if it's changing a job, whatever that is, be there for you. When it comes to your twin flame journey, it's always about focusing on yourself as a divine feminine so that your journey can be able to move forward. Loving yourself, being there for you, that is what helps your journey to move forward it's also about the divine masculine needing to focus on themselves so that they can be able to move forward on their journey so the message coming through is rather than focusing on out there or focusing on what your divine masculine is doing uh, on the 3d be there for you bring everything back to yourself so that's the message that's coming through here the next card that has come out is warrior goddess so you're being reminded that you are a warrior as a divine feminine as a divine masculine you are a warrior we are all made of stars that's what it says we are all made of stars so you you're being reminded that you come from the universe you know from and you are here to shine that's the message that's coming through you are a warrior you've been through so much in your life and you keep getting up and you keep moving forward with strength and with power and whatever challenges come your way you have the power and the strength within to keep moving forward and that is about that is because you know you have all that support and that love and and the help that comes in as well from the universe to help you on your path but you are also here to shine to shine your light bright so that you can be able to do whatever it is that you are here to do so you are a star the message is for you to shine as the warrior that you are it's so really powerful and the last card that came out from this deck is wild and free and it says all good things are wild and free so you're being shown here that this is about you going for the things that you desire. You know, really going for your heart's desires and know that the things that you desire, you know, you don't have to try and be a certain person. Just be yourself. Be free to be who you are. You know, be free and wild in your life. You know, to wild to do the things that you're wanting to do. The things that other people may not understand, but it's not about other people. It's what is lights you up inside. So be wild and free to live your life. That that's the message that's coming through in this card and all good things are wild and free the more you are doing you being your authentic self you know and feeling free to do what you're wanting to do that's going to bring in even more good things into your life so those are the messages that are coming through from that deck the next one is the little box of calm so thank you angels what message is coming through for everyone today what message is coming through for everyone from this deck what messages are coming through for everyone from this deck? Any other message coming through from this deck? Thank you, angels. Do that one more time. Any other message coming through? Okay, so the cards that have come out here. Your calm, your calm mind is the ultimate weapon against your challenges. So relax. And this is by Bryant McGill. So you're being asked to relax, you know, just be in the place of calming your mind. Do certain things that help you to feel calm when it comes to your mind. And it's the ultimate weapon against challenges. When you get into a place of stress and, you know, your mind is not calm, it's racing at, you know, a thousand miles per hour and there's all these things going on. You know, you struggle through those challenges, but when you are calm and, you know, you deal with the situation, you take those three deep breaths and then you go on and you deal with that situation, it's like that weapon against whatever the challenge is that you may be facing. So take three deep breaths when there's something going on and, you know, and calm your mind and then respond that's the message that's coming through and you know the more you are in that state of being calm and you know and then responding that helps you to actually have that ultimate weapon against that challenge that you may be facing the next card that has come out you are exactly where you need to be so you are being reminded that where you are right now in your life this is exactly where you need to be i used to struggle with this 
message at the start of my journey to think that I, you know, thinking, oh, I really want to be there. But the message is that, you know, everything is part of the divine plan. There's always a bigger picture. You are exactly where you need to be right now for your soul growth, for the things that you need to learn, for you to be able to move forward towards the life that you are here to live. You know, you are exactly where you need to be. And it's about you knowing that and accepting that because this is the life that you are here living right now so you are exactly where you need to be let your worries drift away like clouds so beautiful message so this is about you letting your worries dr drift away like clouds give your worries to the creator you know give your worries to the angels find inner peace let them drift away like the clouds ask the angels to come in and take away that worry from you Call upon Archangel Michael. I tend to do this and ask Archangel Michael to cut cords for me with that, those worries and fears that may try to come in. So let your worries drift away like, like, like clouds. Surrender all that to the Creator and stand in your place of having faith and, 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 and peace as well. The next card that has come out is our greatest defense against stress is the ability to change our minds, to change our thinking. And that's a quote by Goldie Horn. And this is about saying positive, you know, thinking positive thoughts. And it's the greatest defense against, um, you know, against stress. Because when you're thinking negative thoughts, it starts, you know, you start with one negative thought. It, you know, you start to think more negative thoughts. They get bigger and bigger. And you start to get into a place of anxiety, a place of panic, a place of fear. And it, it puts you in stress. But, you know, when you change those thoughts, you notice that negative thought that is coming in, you change it round and you make it into a positive affirmation and you know, and you start thinking positive thoughts, then that is going to create an even better life for you. It takes away all that stress. It helps you to find that peace. So our greatest defense against stress is the ability to change our mind. So to change your thinking from that negative thought to change it to positive thinking. And that will help you to be able to find that calm as well when it comes to your mind and also to release that stress so really powerful and the last card that came out is focus on one thing at a time so you know you're being shown here that you don't have to try and rush and do so much at one time you know focus on one thing at a time it will help you to be more productive as well when it comes to your day-to-day -day life and work with the creator or the universe when it comes to whatever it is that you may be working on always ask for help for you to be able to do those things so beautiful messages coming through okay the next deck that we are going to bring in we are going to bring in as well the um oracle of the mermaids so i used this deck a while ago actually to do a series that is in the playlist and you know it was a really powerful series to help you as well on your journey so you can check out uh, the series um on on the playlist and you know it, it we went through all the cards to see what messages were coming through for everyone so thank you angels what messages are coming through for everyone today what messages are coming through for everyone from this deck okay so let's see the cards that have come out so the first one that came out is air and it says breathing deep entering into life entering breathing deep entering into life exchange of life bringing energies so i really feel that this is about breathing and you know just being in that place of taking three deep breaths when something is starting to stress you out or you know certain fears coming in take those three deep breaths calm yourself you know breathing really helps you to get into that place of being calm and you know and you really sort of come back to your center as well so that's the message that's coming through so breathing deep exchange of life bringing energies and it helps you to really just be able to think about things in a clearer way as well so that's the message that's coming through with this card so it's really about you know sort of like you know air is also when you think about air it's also the, when it comes to the elements air is about the mind so that's why I'm really getting this message A is about the mind and it's about not being in your mind too much you know calming your mind and coming back into your heart when it comes to all the things that you you to your life and the things that you desire everything rather than be in your mind too much come back to your heart you know that's what we're all learning right now to get out of that place of being in the mind too much 
and coming back to your heart to follow your heart when it comes to all areas of your life so that's the big message that's coming through with this card okay and then the next card that we've got is endurance and you know this is about and it says keep going and that's exactly what it is it's about not giving up you know it's about you moving forward you know as a divine feminine on your twin flame journey keep moving forward with strength and power you know don't give up on your journey it's not about giving up it's about seeing that you are learning so much from this experience the things that you're going through on your journey and you're growing so much from who you were before to who you are now and you continue to keep growing every day so you're being asked to keep going and also to trust that what you desire when it comes to this love is is coming in but you have to have that faith you have to keep going as well on your journey you have to trust that all that you're experiencing is there to bring you in all that is truly meant for you so you're being asked to keep going if you're a divine masculine watching this it's about not giving up on the love that you desire you know not giving up on working on yourself releasing the karmic situations the things that need to go you know it, it, sometimes it may be a lot to deal with but the message is keep going so this is a message for you today it's about endurance it's about knowing that you know you are growing and learning from all that you have been going through or that you're going through in your life and it's about you continuing to keep going the more you have that determination and perseverance to keep going the more you will reach your goals as well it may be something that you're working on you know the more you are determined and you keep going the more you will succeed so beautiful messages coming through okay so what have i not used yet so we've got as well a message for the divine feminine so um thank you angels this is a divine feminine power message what messages are coming through for the divine feminine today so the cards that have come out here so we've got be grateful for everything it's a divine feminine card but deck but these are messages for everyone so if you're a divine masculine watching this is also a message for you be grateful for everything you know the big things the small things in your life there is so much for you to be grateful for you wake up every morning you are you know seeing another day that's something for you to be grateful for the birds that are singing that's something for you to be grateful for the bed the bed that you sleep in that's something for you to be grateful for so you know be grateful for everything whatever it is you know just think about the things that are in your life and you know do a gratitude list speak your gratitude out write it all down morning evening both whatever but be in the place of gratitude and that is going to open doors to bring in more of the things that you desire. The next card that came out is you have the power. So you're being reminded that you have the power to create the life that you desire. You have the power to live the life that you desire. You have the power to change your life. Walk away from the old and move forward towards the new. Walk away from what's no longer serving you and move forward towards the things that light you up inside, the things that are your heart's desires. You have the power to do whatever it is that you're wanting to do but you have to trust in yourself you have to have the confidence as well in yourself but you have the power connect more to that divine power that is within connect more to your true self you know connect to that divine love that is within to help you as well when it comes to all areas of your life connect to the power of the creator so that you can be able to get through whatever challenges may be in the way to get to where you're truly meant to be so you have the power to do anything in your life is the message that's coming through and the last card that came out is raise your vibration so this is about raising your vibration in the message that i did in the thought for your day it was all about elevating your thoughts you know getting away from the doubt and the fears and you know raising your vibration to peace love joy you know being in the place of loving your life the more you your vibration is high the more you're feeling good in your life the more you're loving your life the more you're seeing the good that is happening in your life being grateful that is going to help to open up the doors to all the dreams that you have to all that is meant for you to come into your life so you're being asked to raise your vibration do certain things in your day-to-day -day life that are there to help you to raise your vibration okay the next deck that we have as well we've got um the oracle of the angels so thank you angels what messages are coming through for everyone from this deck what messages are coming through for everyone 
Okay, so the messages that we have here, the first one is blessing. So this is beautiful. And you know, you can see it's like that light coming from above and it's all that is all coming upon you. This is about you being blessed from above. You know, that's about you seeing all those blessings that are coming in for you from the universe and then being grateful for everything, being grateful for the life that you have and, you know, and all those blessings that are coming in for you. So that's the message that's coming through. See the blessings that are in your life. Know that you are a blessing for being here on earth right now. And, you know, and really sort of open your heart. You know, you can see there's that light that's coming through on the heart as well there. That's about your connection to Mother Earth and connection to above as well. Above as, as below. So it's about that connection that you have and, you know, and realizing that you are a blessing to this earth by being who you are, by being on this journey, by learning the things that you're learning and growing and healing as well on your journey. So you are here to help the rest of the planet. That's the message that's really coming through. So you are a blessing, but also know that you are being blessed in so many ways as well to help you on your journey and you know and the more you're opening your heart to love as well the more you're sending out those blessings to others so that's the message that's coming through with this and the next card that came out the last one from this deck is about opportunity so this is powerful you're being shown here that there are great opportunities that are coming into your life the more you're moving forward in your life feeling good raising your vibration being grateful and you know be opening your arms ready to receive what the universe is there to give you the more opportunities are coming into your life so you know be in a place of joy and don't miss out you know be in the present moment as well and so that you don't miss out on the opportunities that are coming in and those opportunities will come in for you in all sorts of different ways you know you ask and then it is given but you have to be in the present moment not lost in the worries of the future or things of the past but be in the present moment so that you don't miss those opportunities when they're coming in but you're being shown here that you are being blessed with opportunities for the things that you desire. You know, that can be that blessing of the opportunity to have the communication with your divine masculine or your divine feminine or the opportunity to for that love that you desire to come in for a change in your life. You know, there is an opportunity that is coming in, but you're being asked to have your hands open, ready to receive, to have your heart open, ready to receive as well. But they are blessings and opportunities that are coming into your life. Really beautiful. Okay, so the cards that I haven't used yet. So we've got here um, as well, a message for you is what this message is. So we've got, this is, will be, if you're a divine masculine watching, this is a message for you from your divine feminine. So thank you, angels. What message is coming through for the divine masculine from their divine feminine? Well, if you're a divine feminine watching, this is your message to your divine masculine. Okay, so the first message that has come out here is that your divine feminine is saying to you, I wish you were here. So as a divine feminine, you're wishing your divine masculine was here, but you know, you're there as a divine masculine, your divine feminine is wishing that you were with them. And then they're also saying to you, you melt my heart. So, you know, you think about your divine masculine and that melts your heart. So divine masculine, that's a message for you. Your divine feminine is also saying to you, you are everything I could ever want. So, you know, you are all that they are desiring and everything that they could ever want for a relationship, for the love that they desire. So they're saying to you, you are everything I could ever want. And they're also saying to you, I feel what you are going through physically. So whatever you may be going through, you know, ascension symptoms, your divine feminine feels that as well physically because you are that connected. So that's a message that's coming through for you as well as a divine masculine and also that our love is eternal. So the love that you have, your divine feminine is coming through to you saying it is eternal. We are truly meant to be. And if it's a divine, if you're a divine feminine watching, this is your message. These are your messages to your divine masculine. That's this love that you share is eternal and then a message for the divine feminine from your divine masculine so thank you angels what messages are coming through from the divine masculines so straight out there so the divine masculines are saying to you okay so let's say you take my breath away so if you're a divine feminine, this is what your divine masculine is saying to you. You take my breath away because you certainly do. They think about you and it just takes their breath away. And they're also saying you light me up inside. So they think about you, it lights them up inside. You are the one that they truly want to be with. And they're also saying to me, you matter to me. 
so you truly matter to them and they want you to know this you know they may not be showing you that on the 3d but they're saying to you you matter to me you know and the last message is let's start a family together so they're wanting some sort of commitment it may be a family of having children together bringing your children together or, you know, a family of just the two of you, a family of having pets, whatever that may be. It's about that coming together, that commitment, that being together, living together, having a life together. That's what they're saying to you. Let's start a family together because you matter to me. Really beautiful. Okay, so the last deck that I was guided to that we are going to use today is the Divine Feminine Transformation Affirmations. And this is a message for you as a Divine Masculine or as a Divine Feminine. So thank you, angels. So this is a message from your higher self. What messages are coming through for everyone today? What messages are coming through from everyone's higher self? From everyone watching's higher self, what messages are coming through? These are messages to help you on your journey as well. What messages are coming through? Okay, so the cards that have come out here for you. So a few cards that have come out is, I accept myself as I am. So this is about self-love. This is about loving yourself. And, you know, these are affirmations that you can say, you know, coming from your higher self, reminding you, I accept myself as I am. Love yourself as you are. Know that you are valuable and you are loved beyond measure. But it also all has to start with you. So I accept, I accept myself as I am. And these are affirmations that you can say to yourself, even repeat after me as well. I accept myself as I am. And then the next card that came out is I love myself. So this is about that self-love, giving to yourself when it comes to everything. I accept myself as I am. I love myself. Really beautiful. The next card that has come out is I am love. So this is about you knowing that you are a divine being of love. You know, you operate from love in everything that you do. You're learning unconditional love as well on this journey as a divine masculine or a divine feminine. So I am love, really beautiful. I, I only need my approval, not anyone else's. So this is a reminder for you to, you know, when it comes to whatever it is that you're doing in your life, if it's changing and walking away from something, you don't need anyone else's approval, only yours. So I only need my approval, not anyone else's. So it's about going back to your heart and doing what your heart is guiding you to do and moving forward with those things as well. I am changing my perception. So if there's something that you're looking at from a certain perspective, it's about changing your perspective, seeing things from a more positive way, in a, posit in a more positive way, changing your perception so that you can see things in, in a way that helps you to be able to move forward. So I am changing my perception. I am patience. And we had the card about practicing patience before. So, you know, on your twin flame journey as a divine feminine, this is a big lesson that we all learn you know it's about having patience so you can say that to yourself i am patience and having patience is actually about it's like patience broken down and it's positive it's positively acting towards interesting enriching nurturing and caring endeavors so that's about you you know doing those things whilst you are having patience you know patience on your journey but you are being positive when it comes to in to your life and to everything that you're doing and you're acting towards interesting nurturing and caring endeavors so you are taking action in your life you know that's about you doing things for yourself loving yourself you know focusing on self-love doing the things that you enjoy doing things that are interesting to you that are nurturing towards you being caring towards yourself towards others you know being there to just really do the things that you love the endeavors things that light you up inside so that is what you do during this time of being patient it's not like you're being patient you just you're just waiting for something to happen when it comes to your twin flame journey you're patient and doing all those things in your life okay the next card is i forgive myself so if you're holding on to anything of the past as a divine masculine or you know as a divine feminine that's the message i forgive myself forgive yourself of the past open up your energy so you can be able to bring in more positive things in your life I am bringing peace into my life. This is beautiful. This is about you doing the things that help you to feel calm and find that inner peace. So, you know, walking away from things that no longer serve you, the old that is not fulfilling or, you know, and really doing the things that bring you peace. Uh, so I am bringing peace into my life. 
I am abundant in all areas of, of my life. So this is about you just knowing that you're abundant because you've got the creator by your side, helping you, supplying you being the source of all the things that you desire and you know moving away from that victim mentality of lack of not having certain things but being in the place of being of saying i am abundant in all areas of your life and the more you feel abundant within yourself the more that abundance comes in but it all has to start with you so i am abundant in all areas of my life and the last message for today is i am a warrior who does not give up so whatever may be going on in your life you know there was another message about a warrior as well warrior goddess i think it was and it's about you not giving up continuing to keep moving forward as a divine feminine on your twin flame journey i am a warrior who does not not give up and I continue to keep moving forward and to trust that the universe has got me that the creator will bring in what is meant for me at the right time as a divine masculine even if you may get knocked down and all sorts of things happen tower moments in your life you get up and you say i am a warrior who does not give up and you keep moving forward so that's the last message that's coming through for your message for you today i am a warrior who does not give up so keep moving forward trusting you have all the love and support to help you on your journey i hope you have a great day guys i'll see you on the next video love peace positivity and light